Note, the following video depicts a specific configuration of the notebook. The same removal and replacement procedures apply to all configurations of the notebook. Before you begin, remove the battery, optical drive, rear corner covers, base enclosure, wireless module, solid state drive, fan, and system board. Removal. Using minimal force, lift the locking bar up on the touchpad board ZIF connector and disconnect the touchpad board ribbon cable from the touchpad board. Caution. Use care to prevent damaging the ZIF connector and ribbon cable. Peel back the plastic shielding and grounding tape that cover the touchpad board and bracket. Remove the three 2.5 mm P1 Phillips head screws that secure the touchpad board bracket to the top cover. Lift the touchpad board bracket off of the alignment pins on the top cover and remove. Remove the three 2 mm P0 Phillips head screws that secure the touchpad board to the top cover. Lift the touchpad board off of the alignment pins on the top cover and remove. Important! Take care not to scratch the display panel screen when removing the touchpad board. Place the touchpad board into a static dissipative bag. Replacement Remove the touchpad board from the static dissipative bag. Place the touchpad board onto the alignment pins on the top cover. Replace the three 2 mm P0 Phillips head screws that secure the touchpad board to the top cover. Place the touchpad board bracket onto the alignment pins on the top cover. Replace the three 2.5 mm P1 Phillips head screws that secure the touchpad board bracket to the top cover. Replace the grounding tape and plastic shielding that cover the touchpad board and touchpad board bracket. Insert the touchpad board ribbon cable into the touchpad board ZIF connector on the touchpad board and press the locking bar down to lock the cable into place. Caution! Use care to prevent damaging the ZIF connector and ribbon cable. <laughs> 